Hi, you clicked on this link because you want to know how to take an x-ray of the ring finger and I'm going to show you how to do it perfectly every time. All right, so this is a ring finger, fourth finger x-ray exam and it's just like the other fingers in the thumb. You're going to do four views because it's a multi-joint and on those four views, it's very simple. It's AP or PA, I'm sorry. It's a PA, oblique, the other oblique, and a lateral. And so what we're gonna do is I'll show you how to do four of those positions. Okay, so the first one's very, very easy, just like the other fingers. You wanna keep everything as flat on the table as possible. Uh, central ray is gonna be about right here, kind of at the base of the finger if you can, and it can go back here into the metacarpals. So that's the PA view. The, uh, the uh, oblique is gonna be 45 degrees up, and that'll look like that. The other oblique is gonna be this way. And try to get it 45 degrees. And then the lateral for this is going to be a little tricky because this doesn't have any tendons back here to hold the fourth finger back. So uh, you can take a pen and what you're gonna do is you're gonna make a fist with the other fingers and then with a pen or some other object you're just gonna kind of push this one back as far as it can go. Have them do it, obviously. And then you take the picture, or you take the x-ray right here. If you're trying to look at this joint here, you can roll it a little bit forward or a little bit backwards to throw the first two knuckles off, off that joint so it's not superimposed upon each other. And that's how you take a um, x-ray of the ring finger, PA, oblique, oblique, and a lateral. Okay, thanks for watching. Please comment, share, and like, and the next video is going to be of the little finger.